Well, good Friday morning. I'm Ashley Cunha with your Conjo Valley This Morning update. A lengthy prison sentence was announced on Thursday for a suspect in the San Angelo road rage case. 33 year old Michael Sanchez pled guilty for an aggravated assault charge for an incident in March of last year. Prosecutors said he assaulted a driver after an altercation where the victim's vehicle was involved in a near miss accident. The driver was assaulted and stabbed and is still recovering. A judge sentenced Sanchez to 28 years in prison. And Angelo State University now has an agreement with the country's top national security agency, giving students the ability to earn unique degree opportunities. The commandant of the NSA's Cryptologic School was in San Angelo for a signing ceremony Thursday morning with Angelo State President Brian May. The agreement gives NSA employees access to bachelor and master's degrees through ASU Security Studies Center. The program provides continuing education for national security employees, maintaining credentials for work at NSA facilities in suburban Washington, and around the world. I think this is uh, absolutely wonderful. We get to help the military, you know, the military who are protecting this nation. We get better, more intelligent students. It helps Angelo State, it helps our department. Thank you, sir. ASU is one of only seven schools in the country with an NSA degree program. And many San Angelo teachers are back in their classrooms this week getting ready for next week's start of the school year. Veteran teachers offer some advice for first year teachers. One teacher says it'll all come together even though the first few days can seem overwhelming. More than 200 teachers this year are new to the San Angelo School District. Now let's see what's happening in weather with Tabon Sharifi. Tabon, are things really heating up in the Concho Valley today? We will continue seeing the heat today, but just a few degrees above average, 98 degrees for your high temperature, mostly sunny skies. Winds will be out of the south, 5 to 15 miles per hour. As we head into the evening and overnight hours, a low temperature tonight of 74 degrees, partly cloudy skies, seeing winds diminish a little bit to 10 miles per hour, still out of the south, and continuing those southerly winds out of the south, 5 to 15 miles per hour tomorrow, high temperature of 99 degrees, so just slightly more warmer than today, but still seeing a lot of sunshine. Your seven day forecasting rain and thunderstorm chances on the way starting on Sunday evening.